definitely had the love of basketball because my husband loves basketball and ever since I met him has played in leagues and tournaments. So Trey's been around basketball his entire life and so wanting to be like his dad, like a typical boy, he definitely took on the love of basketball and I mean, since I can remember. My dad would sometimes come out if he would see me shooting, he'd just shoot around with me. And I would be eventually just start messing around playing one-on-one -on -one. and that's how I started shooting behind my head because that was the only way I could get it over him and make it. So it just, it stuck with me since till like eighth grade when I finally switched it. But I mean, me and my dad, we always played. My favorite game was horse. So if you ever played, we'd always play horse. But I always had a hoop in my front yard. So whenever I was bored, I could just grab a basketball, go shoot around. And that was something that I just, that just took my mind off of everything and just have my own little zone to myself. Yeah, I'll say, it. just a junior, remember, he finishes with 30 points. And I mean, it seemed like every time he took a shot or every time he was at the free throw line, it was a crucial point in the ball game. Yeah. Trey's development uh, has been interesting. He, because he is fairly quiet, sometimes a little unassuming, you don't see him developing into the dominant player that he's become. He hasn't always been this way. I mean, he, he had to get better. He played freshman basketball for us. Now maybe, maybe that's my fault for not seeing where he could be, but really that's where he was as a freshman is he was at that level. Now as a sophomore, he was a varsity starter. So, you know, he, he did develop quickly, but his work ethic is good. He, he, he studies the game, he watches it, he plays it. So his approach is solid. I was expecting at least play on JV, but I mean, I didn't let that deteriorate me. I just knew with hard work that it would eventually pay off. So I just kept working, kept getting stronger, working on my game on my own. And now I can see him here and going to San Diego State. So it's changed a lot. I never knew where basketball would take him and was hoping at one point it would help him obviously get a good education. And the fact that we're here, I'm, I'm thrilled. I, you know, it's a huge relief for us as parents to know that number one, he's gonna have his education paid for and um, two, be able to kind of continue playing basketball, which is his love. To see a young man grow up and to achieve one of his goals, he's not done, but to achieve a goal of his to be able to play in front of his family and friends and coaches and teammates, obviously thrilled to death for that, for Trey. And he's gonna fit in great there. It's gonna be a great, it's gonna be a great experience for him. I mean, it should be fun. I mean, we have a great class coming in, so I've talked to all of them, they're very excited. I mean, I get to stay home, so I'm already getting everyone talking to me on Twitter saying they're gonna to come to the games. Even when I go to the San Diego State games, people are coming up to me and saying they're gonna to come to the Saints game, so I mean, it's, uh, it's pretty crazy, but I'm glad I have that, that sort of attention and people are glad that I'm staying home.